In a few other videos on this channel, we go into the usefulness of mind tools like HemiSync. In fact, we make the argument that the methodology of HemiSync's flagship program, the Gateway Experience, mimics almost point for point what you would experience in a magical lodge. Today, we're going to extend that argument to hypnosis. Because the four stages of hypnosis like Henny Sink's Gateway is an esoteric art form that you can use to your great advantage if you know how to do so. But first, what are the four stages of hypnosis? The four stages of hypnosis are induction, deepening, sleep, and waking. The first stage of hypnosis is induction. During the induction, the person is put into a state of deep relaxation, and their mind and body are relaxed. Next stage, the person enters the deepening phase, where they are placed into a more intense altered state of consciousness. After going deeper, another level of relaxation allows them to penetrate more profound levels of consciousness. The next stage is where the programming or affirmations or problem solving occurs. This is also called the suggestibility stage. Now let's talk about how the stages of hypnosis are related to the magical process, which is related to Henny Sink. So what do hypnosis, Henny Sink, and magical rituals all have in common? Henny Sink, magical practices, and hypnosis all share a common factor. They are all designed to immerse you into a more expanded level of existence. All three practices are designed to expand your mind and alter your state. Here is a brief description of each. Beginning with hypnosis, you are given suggestions as to what your mind should be focused on. This occurs in an environment designed to take you into a safe, altered state. When in this state, your unconscious mind will accept the ideas you are being given and act upon them to become your reality. Now let's move on to the HemiSync Gateway Experience. HemiSync is a brainwave entrainment product. It uses sound to synchronize your brainwaves to an alpha state. When using the Gateway Experience, you expand your mind and immerse yourself in the deeper levels of your unconscious. This is done by putting on headphones or earbuds and listening to progressive sessions designed to expand your consciousness. In comparison, occult practices of the Magical Lodge immerse you into an expanded state of consciousness through ritual and ceremony. It's designed to take you deep into altered states of consciousness. The Lodge uses rituals, ceremonies, sacred space, and circle casting. All are designed to help you connect with your own divine source in a safe environment that will help deepen your spiritual experiences. Take note, the point of the idea here is expanding your mind because that's the point of it all. All three practices are designed to take you to a more expanded state of existence within your consciousness. Although each practice seems different, our producer has found through experience that they all lead to the same place. The only difference is the depth of the experience but let's use the four stages of hypnosis to illustrate what we mean. The process goes like this. 1. Start or open the temple. 2. Connect to the energy. 3. Do banishing rites and clear the energy. 4. Tune yourself and raise your energy. 5. Focusing and directing the energy. 6. Affirmations and visualization that determine the quality of your energy. First, start or open the temple and connect to the energy. This is induction, followed by a banishing rite, which is also clearing the energy. Next comes tuning yourself, which is also raising the energy. This is deepening focusing and directing the energy. Lastly are affirmations and or visualizations. Here we determine the quality of energy, and this is also where the power of suggestibility is utilized. As you can see, hypnosis combines a few steps from the other two practices, but the conclusion is clear. We are talking about similar methods with an identical goal, expanding your consciousness. All three practices are designed to take you into a more expanded state of yourself, but by using different methods and tools. And if you can achieve a certain level in one of these methods, you can do the same in the other two with ease. That's what our producer did, and that's why he believes these three practices are actually the same. But did you notice what we haven't talked about yet? We haven't said a word about spells and initiations because they're irrelevant. If you can enter an expanded state of consciousness using hypnosis, why make altars to your ancestors? Why pray to foreign gods in archaic languages that you don't know how to pronounce? Why take oaths and join partially secret organizations? You can get the same results using hypnosis. Hemi sync with a shell of magical ritual if you want a touch of the dramatic. Your conscious, subconscious, and unconscious minds have a fantastic ability to connect because they are all different rooms in the same mansion. 
For example, suppose you're using something like HemiSync's Gateway Experience. In that case, you will undoubtedly have experienced a level of connection and expansion that is very similar to initiation or magical working. The Gateway Experience has hypnosis baked in. If you want all the details, the Department of Army Intelligence to classify documentation on the Gateway Experience that's been floating around the internet for years. In fact, we even have the full document here on the channel. So if hypnosis, the Gateway Experience, and magic are all the same, what does it mean? First off, it means that hypnosis is fantastic, and if you have any interest in these subjects, you may want to start with self-hypnosis, because self-hypnosis is empowering for you. Self-hypnosis is one tool that all three methods rely on. But where can you learn self-hypnosis from knowledgeable, professional teachers? There is one place we know of that our producer has used since 2009, and that's the Learn Hypnosis in 5 Days class from Hypnosis Downloads. That's right, you can learn hypnosis in under a week, and use that new skill for the rest of your life. The cool thing about it is you can test the waters, and it's 100% free. But if you do choose to buy some of their materials, you will not pay more than $15 per session. That's amazing because most hypnotherapists won't even answer an email for under 100. And in my our opinion, Mark Tyrell and the team at Hypnosis Download have some of the best hypnosis training online. I recommend them highly. So if you want to start learning hypnosis yourself, start with the Learn Hypnosis class in 5 days. Then if you're ready, take a look at something like the Gateway Experience. Because Gateway is magical, but knowing how to go into that state before you even begin is the way of mastery. And yet, there's still one unanswered question that we need to address. Why do you need to do any of this? Whether people believe hypnosis works or not, they can understand why they might need it. Hypnosis is famous for weight loss, confidence boosting, and the famous quit smoking in 88 hours treatments. People who are interested in out-of-body experiences are drawn to hemi-sync. And the practice of magic attracts two types of people, those who want to control every aspect of the world, and those who wish to merge with a higher being, whether it be a holy guardian angel, or some old world god, or whatever yellow brick road the magical lodge has you following. But, the point of the entire enterprise is to merge different aspects of yourself together into an organized whole, instead of a conflicted human being looking back at you in the mirror. Because until you merge yourself together like an organized compound, you are still a surrogate of your oversoul. And there's nothing wrong with that. It's how we all got here and got our chance to make something of this mixed bag of soul seeds we think of as I. But what happens when the land produces no crops? That land gets tilled and the oversoul starts again. And yes, that new beginning will still be you, in a sense. And there is nothing wrong with that either. After all, how do you think you got here? But does contemplating a reincarnated self make you feel all warm and fuzzy inside? Probably not. Especially when you consider how much of a gamble landing inside the right womb at the right time in history is. So the best way to continue, as you, is to merge within yourself, become an independent being, and cut the cord from the oversoul. This is the goal. And it's what was hoped for you from the moment you were combined together by your oversoul. In fact, the entire soul world you came from is waiting to see how it all goes, like a good television drama. But it's up to us to take the advantage and do the work. And the work starts with self-development. Hypnosis is where you start because it's foundational for training your mind to be still enough to make changes. But after that, you can, and we strongly advise that you should, learn to go deeper. Because you can use these alternate states of consciousness to merge parts of yourself. At first, it will be to accomplish personal grand goals. Then later on, you will want to increase the light of consciousness into your being. This is an all-natural internal progression. As we said before, Integration is the goal, and all we want to do is help you along the path.